Hey guys, we're picking up on the optical design that we started last class. Um, you can see this is what mine finished, um, not finished, but <laughs> beginning um, to color with Prismacolor colored pencils. Um, like I said in the intro, you're going to try to pick colors that are next to each other on the color wheel, um, pinks to purples. Um, as you can see, I've got some greens, turquoise. I'm going to fill these white spots up on this second one here, the green, with um, some blues. I'm going to back up just a little bit and show you um, ooh, gross. Um, what should be sharpied. Only these lines. You do not want to sharpie these wavy lines. Only the curved up and the curve down. Okay. Once you've got all of those finished, I want you to erase this middle line that goes through. So it's going to leave um, kind of this little gap like you can see here. Almost looks like the shape of an eye. Okay. All right. So I'm going to show you just on the back of this mat board here. I was testing out some different colors. So um, this one is going to be my darkest one. You're going to achieve this look by doing darkest down here on the edge and then doing a medium color, a lighter color, and then I kind of used white to blend it. Okay, the coolest way, the best way to use these Prismacolors is to really blend them and um, they end up looking like a paint because they're so nice and thick. So you're going to use this one on the edge and you can get kind of dark with it and then kind of pull out just a little bit of that one. I'm going to go to my next darkest. Okay, fill in that just a little. Get those to blend. Then I'm going to grab my lighter one. Okay, that's going to be the middle. I'm going to put just a little, not go too dark. And then I'm going to add the white right there. So it's really going to look like it's popping out. Okay, same thing that's going to happen on this side. So it'll be this dark one. It'll be this middle one. And you'll have this lighter one. Okay, and then again, you're going to do the white. Okay, so essentially that's what it's going to look like. I'm going to do a little demo on my actual piece for you. Start here, go just in the corner. Filling it up just a little bit. Try to blend this one. And this is all about um, shading. You're just using colored pencils this time. Okay, same as we used the regular drawing pencils. You're, if you imagine this being a 6B, this being a 4B, this being a 2B, we're just going, we're trying to show the lighter part in the middle so that it creates this illusion that it's coming out. Okay, so this is going to take a while. Just kind of take your time. If you want to go back, I'm probably going to have to go back and fill some of these places in. But for now, I just want to see that this, how this looks. One thing I want to remind you of, again, is trying to pick these analogous colors. Okay, I, I chose to fill these spots in the eyes um, with the opposite color. Um, I may do a different color than these as I continue through, um, I, you're, it's really up to you, but each one, just remember, should try to be those three to five colors that are in that same color family. All right, good luck.